I became undocumented when I was in senior year of high school. It wasn't easy to say this publicly at first because there is a huge stigma on being undocumented in the Korean community. I thought the world was over because all the all-nighters that I pulled for the finals and 100 hours of volunteering, it all resulted into nothing. Even though I got into UC San Diego, I couldn't go because I did not qualify for any financial aid. My teachers and friends were asking me which college I was going to, and I told them I was going to a community college to save money, but in fact, I just could not tell them about my new secret. Two years into community college, President Obama signed Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals, which gave me a chance to pursue my dream and also stay in America where my friends and family live. I became more aware of the undocumented issue and started advocating for the API community. I joined Dream Summer, an internship program for undocumented students pushing for comprehensive immigration reform in 2013. We held a vigil in front of a federal building and marched to Senator Ed Royce and Kevin McCarthy's office to urge them to push forward with the immigration reform. I got into UCLA and continued my education, doing research and shaping my dream of becoming a science teacher. My grandfather used to be an elementary school principal in Korea and I wanted to follow his footsteps. Unfortunately, my DACA renewal was denied in college and I became undocumented again. However, I did not let it stop me from pursuing my education and got my teaching credential in biology. I found joy and passion in teaching, but I cannot apply for a job due to my status. I thought being undocumented meant weakness, something that I needed to hide. However, it taught me to be resilient, work hard, and have a positive outlook even your future may seem so uncertain at times. My goal as a teacher is to build a classroom that welcomes students from diverse backgrounds. I want it to be a safe place where students feel a sense of belonging. I want to give back to the community and I want to help others. Current immigration system has caused so much pain and hardship across communities. We have families that are separated and young, capable people unable to contribute to the society. No one group is saved until all of us are saved. There is a power and purpose in unity. And that is why I'm advocating for citizenship for all.